It is raining, there are chickadees singing outside, and today my cat was extra snuggly. It has been good. I'm gonna be honest, I still super don't feel like making a video today, uh, even though I'm having a good day. I just don't have a lot to talk about, so I really don't know what this video is gonna turn out to be. I'm just kind of going to sit here and see what comes out of my face. So, yeah. Literally, the only time that I have worn my binder out of the house was for exercise. I went for a run one day and I wore my binder because I don't have any workable sports bras right now. So the only thing that I had to keep my chest under control was a binder, which worked really well for that. And it was like super confidence boosting to feel that comfortable while also working out and feeling awesome. So that was pretty cool, but that is the only time that I have worn a binder out of the house. There was one time when I was on a trip with some friends where I did dress as a boy and try to like have a deeper voice, which wasn't very successful. I can do it, but then I got nervous around people and did not exactly sound super masculine, but enough to make people question if I was a boy or a girl or what the heck was happening. So that was kind of fun. But that is the extent of my gender exploration outside my house. So at this point, I'm just really hoping that I get an opportunity to go somewhere without my family. Uh, if I could do that and go somewhere nobody knew me, then I would probably be comfortable doing that. I'm hoping I don't know if I mentioned this before, but I'm hoping that somewhere not super far away from where I live will have um, an Asexual Awareness Week event meetup thing that I could go to. That'd be kind of cool. Um, and I'd probably wear my binder to that if it was a day where I felt comfortable in it, which rapidly realizing that that's basically all the time, regardless of what my demigirl status is doing to me. So. Yeah. I also want to talk just for a quick second uh, about the ace community on Tumblr. I've been scrolling the asexuality tag uh, since last night. <laughs> I was scrolling it before I went to bed and I've been scrolling it since. And while, yeah, there is a lot of people coming in and being awful and mean in that tag for no apparent reason, uh, yeah, even though there is a lot of that, there is definitely more good stuff happening in it. Like, I'm seeing a lot of really nice people, and I might need to, like, get in contact with some of these people who are coming in and, like, questioning things, and I just want to wrap them all up in a giant hug, if they're cool with that. Like, I just, I don't know. I'm feeling a lot of things. I'm very proud of the ACE community on Tumblr for standing up to all of the ridiculousness that's been going on, and... Basically, I just want all the ace friends. All of them. I am off to a good start. I've got like three or four right now, so I'm getting there. Statistically, that's pretty good. So, yeah. Anyway, um, I'm gonna go. I have to be at work today in a couple hours or so, but that's okay. It's a good day to not have to be outside in it, which I don't when I'm working, so that's kind of I think that is it for me, and I will see you on Monday. Yeah, on Monday. Bye.